Next on Comcast Newsmakers, what the Kent School District is doing to improve digital access for its students, including using Internet Essentials. Hi, welcome to Comcast Newsmakers. I'm Sabrina Register. Today we're at the Kent School District, the Tim Clark Creative Media Center. And joining me right now is Stosh Morenci, who is the Executive Director of Information Technology for the Kent School District. Stosh, thanks so much for coming on the program, and sure. I should say, I guess, thanks for having us here sure. today. Uh, Happy New Year to you. Thank you. Same to you. Thank you. Uh, we hear a lot about the importance of technology, the access to, to technology, um, especially uh, for kids who are, um, you know, growing up in, in this digital age. Um, but how important really is it and, and how much of a priority uh, does the Kent School District put on, on kids, um, you know, learning and being un able to understand and function in this digital world? Right. Well, the, uh, one of our board goals involves student achievement and it, it expands that to say through providing digital resources. We really don't think of those digital resources being a replacement to the teacher. You know, the laptop isn't a replacement to the textbook. Uh, the, the laptops, the technology, the internet, all these things are doing is just providing uh, additional ways to access these resources. So it, it gets the resources in the students' hands much faster, uh, so it's more accurate. You know, many textbooks are pushing 10 years old. And so these uh, these resources are landing in their hands much faster by having these resources. And these are uh, resources for everybody in the Kent School District, right? Correct. I mean, you want to make sure that everybody is able to succeed. Correct. So uh, equity is very important to us. So all of our teachers, our students, um, they have that access. So we have a one-to-one -one program where uh, students start in the seventh grade getting a laptop. They're issued a laptop. They carry it with them for uh, the duration of their high school uh, program with us. And so, so, how do you see that transformation? A, a, a child in seventh grade first gets that laptop, and what do you see by senior year? What does it mean for a student who is getting ready to graduate from high school and go on to the big scary world afterwards? <laughs> right. <laughs> well, really, I mean, they they can't operate in this society without those skills. So, um, you know, to have someone that comes to you to apply for a job and not be able to use a computer or to type an email or to type in Word or, or any kind of word processing program, you know, it would be unheard of. Um, so giving them these computers, so for many of them it's second nature. It's like, why wouldn't we get this? You know, there's this expectation there. Um, but for others, it's the first time they've ever even touched a computer. Mm. You know, we, we do get a lot of students from other countries in a, you know, either refugee status or similar. Uh, so this is a whole new world for them. So it's really giving them a jump start. Uh, by providing those resources. How does Comcast's Internet Essentials program help students who are, are learning all about you know, this digital world? Uh, well, we find that uh, with our population of students, about 52% of them are what we would call free and reduced lunch kids. So they uh, they are been identified as being a certain level of poverty to enroll in that program. And so because of that, they most likely also have reduced resources for getting access to the Internet. We've also surveyed our students and find that about 82% of them say they have Internet, which means 18% don't. Mm. And so that, uh, that program is really helping to close that gap for us. While we provide these students laptops and they can get on the Internet while they're in our buildings, they can get on the Internet at certain buildings in the community like libraries. Um, you know, what can they do at home if they don't have Internet? They've got this tool that connects them to all these resources, but if there's no connection. You know, right. So it? without a program like Internet Essentials, they're they're having it at school, but they don't have that continuation it's like outside. Give, like of school. giving them a blank textbook. <laughs> right. Yeah, so. Not very helpful. Right. Well, great. Well, thank you so much for talking to us. Any any final thoughts on uh, just improving digital you know knowledge for students? Oh, it's it's all about access. Um, you know, if if we can get the resources in the hands of the teachers and the students, um, you know, it's it's natural to them to run with it. Yeah, so. they're actually better at it than we are. Aren't exactly. <laughs> Stosh, thanks so much for joining us. Thanks for having us. Yeah, I appreciate it. Thanks for watching Comcast Newsmakers.